you much. I would like to request Professor Dr. Muhammad Masum Iqbal, Dean Faculty of Business and Entrepreneurship, DIU, to deliver his inaugural speech with us. Okay. Uh, thank you, Madam Simran. Am I audible? Can you yes, hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You are. Okay. Audible. Thank you so much for one second, uh, Madam Simran. Mm. On this occasion, and very good evening uh, from Bangladesh uh, to all the participants, all the viewers, and I welcome you all. Uh, to this social business creation SBC information session. And today we are having some distinguished persons or distinguished personalities uh, on this uh, on this occasion uh, to disseminate, uh, to share uh, some piece of information about this competition and to share their experiences with the potential participants in this global competition and training platform or training program. And as Simran has said, we are having some distinguished speakers. Madam Dr. Maithai, Mr. Freswa, uh, Mr. Mesbro Rahman, and our pride at Johar Akhtapolin, our SBC alumnus. So they are the individuals, so they are the distinguished persons who will be sharing their experience and the different pieces of information of this competition uh, with all the participants. So once again, I welcome you all to this information disseminating session about social business competition or creation competition. And this is the sixth edition. And this is being organized by ACC Montreal, but locally, our university, Daffodil International University is organizing in Bangladesh. You know, our university, Daffodil International University, DIU, is one of the largest and one of the top ranked private universities in our country. And we are organizing this event each year, like last few years, a few years in a row, we are organizing this event. So this year, we'll be organizing a great event, I hope. And it will be a very good competition. A lot of participants will be participating are participating on this in this competition, and we'll be screening some competent participants, contestants for final event or for final competition. I would like to say a few words about social business. And from this understanding, from my discussion, probably the potential participants will have an understanding why this platform. But this competition is very, very important for them. In fact, uh, truly speaking, social business is a business. But it is a special kind of business, a uh, different type of business. It is not like other businesses, uh, business enterprises. Especially the youngsters have the interest, feeling, emotion, towards social business, they want to do something for the society, they want to do something for the well-being of the society. So many of the youngsters would like to undertake a social business as a means or by which they can contribute to the well-being of the society. And having this notion or understanding in their heart, many of them start a social business, but that is not enough. So whenever we are undertaking a social business or any kind of business, it requires serious determination, serious uh, clear understanding, pragmatic plan approaches, so that they can start a business and execute a social business by which they can contribute to the well-being of the society. And in fact, it can be one of the ways, so it can be a way to make himself or herself or an individual superhuman being, which is stated by our Nobel laureate, Professor Mohamed Yunus. And I believe 
this competition or this social business creation uh, competition is a platform that gives the participants a clear understanding from idea generation to the commercialization of a particular business organization. Because if we look at any business, each and every business is producing either goods or services, whatever. They are serving the community, the people in a given location or in our society. So this is that platform. I'm talking about this social business creation competition. It is a platform that will give a participant, a contestant to think of very seriously about it and to have a clear understanding how to generate idea to how to implement in a pragmatic manner, in a successful manner. They can make sustainable and viable. So it is that platform. I am welcoming all the participants, potential participants to join this competition. I believe it is a platform by which they can become superhuman beings. So with these viewers, I'd like to conclude here. I'm over to Madam Simra. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, sir, for your valuable remarks. Social business creation's vision is to be the global leader in social entrepreneurship education, and their mission is to educate business people to be socially responsible. From a social mission idea at the beginning of the competition, participants will learn how to create profitable businesses with strong social impacts. With that keeping in mind, I would like to request Dr. Mai Tai Kantai, founder of Social Business Creation and Associate Professor of HEC Montreal, Canada, to elaborate this topic more efficiently. So let's welcome Dr. Mai Tai. Hello. Thank you very much for the opportunity to uh, share with you our program, Social Business Creation. Uh, we've been running the program since uh, 2016 and uh, with years of experience of uh, giving the program both online and uh, offline, both in Montreal and uh, uh, in the um, places where students do business with the help of our partner universities. And I'm very happy to have Daffodil International University with us uh, since the very beginning. So you were among the first participants of the first edition. And since then, the program has been growing very well. And I'd like to thank uh, Daffodil University and Professor um, Iba and then uh, Kazi and uh, the team who have been uh, working very hard to grow the program and I'm very proud to see the progress that you have made. So this year 2021, I hope that is the beginning of the new era. So everybody knows now that COVID has created structural change to our economy on a global scale. So every sector is touched. Some sectors uh, are killed and some new sectors are born. More than ever, we see the need for social entrepreneurship. More than ever, we know the need for innovation and creativity in order to reinvent our own sectors, in order to go over the crisis. More than ever, we need, need mm -hmm. uh, entrepreneurs to create social impacts and to lead us uh, not just through this crisis, but also to build a better future for uh, everybody. And so social business creation is a platform where you can learn how to do it. So you could enter the competition with a vague idea of uh, the social impact that you want to create. And you could enter the competition at different uh, stages of the competition. If you want to uh, enter with your own social mission idea, uh, then you will enter with a, a project as you are the creator of a new living lab. And then uh, it's the deadline is on the 28th of February. Uh, and then once we select the living labs, 
then you will start learning through um, different realms. So you start first learn how to create social innovation and then how to uh, um, innovate your business model and then how to execute it and scale it and then how to multiply your impact. So throughout uh, the competitions, you will learn uh, with the materials from uh, developed by HSC Montreal together with the partners. And then you will also benefit from uh, um, our partners coaching. So professor, teachers, and invited uh, mentors and coaches by Daffodil International University will help you with uh, during your work on the field and together with the learning online with our uh, material. And you will also have opportunity to have um, uh, to take part in a live lecture with us uh, dur during uh, each round of the competition. And then uh, also with our competition, uh, the teachers that are involved in uh, helping you, whether directly from HEC Montreal or from uh, Daffodil Universities, they're all trained uh, by our program. And so you are in good hands. And, and then you are able to uh, do your project in your local language. So um, if you are not confident in English, you can still do it in your uh, uh, Banga, uh, Bengali language. And, uh, uh, and then we will be, uh, Daffodil International University will help you with the um, uh, arranging the translation uh, session. And so you can be very confident in uh, your study. You are always uh, working with a strong team uh, that help you during your uh, realization of the project. And now, uh, as for that, it's it is a leading lab, so people can new people can enter the leading lab at any time, as long as the existing people in the leading lab accept you. So either you enter with your own social mission idea, you create your own leading lab, or you can enter after by asking uh, the existing leaving labs to accept you. And uh, we hope to see you in Montreal, but then in order to uh, get to the Montreal round, you have to go through the social innovation round and then business innovation round and then execution round. And um, now I'd like to uh, go back to Simran, uh, where she could invite other people to tell, uh, to share the experience that they had with uh, social business creation in the past. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, ma'am, for your valuable speech. It was wonderful to hear from your, uh, hear from the depth concept of SBC. So now I'd like to request Mr. Kaji Mezbah Rahman, Office of the International Affairs, Daffodil International University, to share the insights of SBC in Bangladesh. Let's welcome Thank Mr. Kaji Mezbah Rahman. Thank you, Simran, for giving me the floor. And very good evening from Bangladesh. And good morning. Uh, for who are living other hemisphere of the globe. So I'm very happy that social business creation competition is expanding globally in different parts of the world. So Daffodil International University is one of the part of interna internationalization of social business creation competition. So this is Kaji Mezbo Rahman. I have been working at the Office of International Affairs alongside uh, I've been working with social business creation competition, competition since its inception. And right now I'm working as the member of SBC Pedagogical Committee. So without prolonging, I would like to share uh, a PowerPoint slide with all of you. So let me share my PowerPoint slide. So, Yes. So now I'm presenting about social business creation in Bangladesh. So Daffodil International University is one of the leading private universities in Bangladesh, having more than 25,000 students. So in a couple of years back, 
DIU signed an agreement with uh, social business creation competition and thus we became the principal regional partner of social business creation competition. But the legacy started in 2016, in the, which is the first edition of social business creation competition. A team from DIU have participated uh, this global competition and became uh, the runner up in the global panel. And I'm very happy to say that I was the team member. Uh, uh, actually, I was the team leader of this uh, team and we own the, uh, the runner up position in the global final. So this is actually the story that how we uh, came with the social business creation competition. And in Bangladesh, uh, social business students forum working as the youth uh, partner of social business creation competition in Bangladesh. So here are some statistics of SBC Bangladesh. Uh, as I mentioned you before that, that we have started with a single team and in we, uh, within four years, more than 113 participants from 23 university have participated in the social business creation competition. And even in the last year, last edition, uh, 59 participants have participated uh, this competition amid the pandemic. So in, in the slide, you can see the growth of SBC participants from Bangladesh. So it's uh, growing up uh, every year. And the social, the participants of social creation competition from Bangladesh are getting success every year. You can see the continuation of success. Well, Every year, our Bangladeshi team, they are, uh, we, they are getting prize, getting scholarship, uh, they are getting uh, seed funding as well. So in total, the, the Bangladeshi team, they, uh, they have achieved, uh, or you can, see, you can say that they have received more than uh, 41,000 Canadian dollar approximately as, as, as the seed funding or the scholarship and uh, as the prize money as well. Also, the Bangladeshi participants, they are joining a Mosaic Summer School program. So in social business creation competition, the participants will have opportunity or will have chance to join this global uh, leadership camp. So in a couple of years back, one of SBC Bangladesh participants, Mr. Haruna Roshi, he received uh, uh, 8,500 Canadian dollar as a scholarship to join this uh, global leadership program. So uh, now I'm telling you actually what SBC Bangladesh does. We represent SBC in Bangladesh. We promote social business. We support other local university and participants. We incubate business ideas. And also we organize regional final in Bangladesh. So we have some resource that SBC Bangladesh participants can have access uh, for their success. We have uh, GIU Innovation Lab, we have co-working space, we have marketing lab. Also, we provide online and offline mentorship support or coaching support, you can say. So we have a coaching portal where Bangladeshi participants, they can apply for uh, coaching. So in this way, actually, we connect SBC participants with SBC alumni, uh, SBC experts as well. So we have a social business creation course in Blended Learning Center. So in this platform, the SBC Bangladesh participants have access to the quality information and reading material and so on. So this is SBC Bangladesh team. We have very dynamic and enthusiastic team in Bangladesh who are promoting social business and social business creation in Bangladesh. So every year we organize regional final and the main objective is uh, to help the Bangladeshi participants. Uh, also, we provide some scholarship as a travel allowance and every year we invite honorable high commissioner Canadian High Commissioner in Bangladesh uh, to join this regional final. 
so this is these are the glimpses of the regional final uh, we organize sbc info session in different university campus so last year we had info session at american international university bangladesh emk center east delta university and as well definitely international university so we also provide support to the ed educator or faculty member to join sbc training of the trainer program so this is a very recent photo we have taken in last month the first cohort of uh, sbc pot program so this is uh, the actually the contact information any time for any support you can contact us we are here to provide you a uh, premium support uh, for your best success so without prolonging i would like to uh, conclude here so before conclusion i uh, like to request the technical team to show a video on sbc uh, regional final so thank you very much now i'm over to the technical team so i'm here if you have any question you can just leave so thank you Thank you so much, Mr. Kazi Mezbah Rahman, for your wonderful representation. So before going on, I'd like to mention once again that uh, we will be having a Q&A session afterwards. So if you have any sort of question, please comment on our live session so that we can pick it up to So now it's time to call one of our SBC alumni of 2019, Ms. Johura Akhtar Pauli, to share her experience. Colleen, you're muted. Colleen, oh. you unmute this. Okay, sorry. Well, thank you, Simran, for wonderful introduction. Assalamu alaikum. Good evening to Bangladesh and good morning to Montreal. Uh, at first, I want to thank the organizers for this wonderful session and special thanks to all our guests and speakers for giving their precious time to this session and our viewers and participants of 2021. So I believe I'm very fortunate because for being a part of SBC, it was almost six months journey. So it is very hard for me to describe this whole journey within some minutes, I guess. So it's not about just a competition or winning a competition. I'm very attached to this. And also I want to share that I'm a better human being after that because now I'm able to work for the people of our country to do social work and social business. I still remember when I started working with SBC, I was not so organized, I was not so skillful, and I have some lack in business ideas also. But now things are completely changed. I'm now more organized and far more prepared. I would like to take the opportunity to thank Professor Mai for SBC. She's a wonderful lady, I must say. Without a doubt, SBC is a platform 
where uh, at first I want to share my slide, then I'll talk about the other thing. Is it okay showing? Yes, it's visible. Okay, thank you. So without a doubt, is this is a platform where people of around the world, different countries, different universities, different culture and caste share their ideas, their knowledge, experience with each other in a single platform. So it is an amazing platform, I must say. So I believe that with the belief of humanity, social business is trying to fulfill the uh, SDG goals to make the world more beautiful for all of us to live. Apart from this, SDC creates opportunity where people are recognized because of their talent and in front of the world. Moreover, SDC uh, supports startups. Startups can grow with the guidance and appreciation and also with the financial support, seed funding. So it is a platform where we can learn social business, create networking among the people of the world. So it all the all the motivation gives me courage to engage with SBC. So why not SBC? So I think these words are not enough to describe SBC and its work. So now I'm going to start my work uh, story I, uh, of shortage. In 2019, me and my teammates start a project named Shotej, which work for the underprivileged people of Bangladesh. We're focusing on two problems. First of all, that we are giving rice to our farmers. And secondly, adultation free food for all. So Shotej is a platform where customer and farmers are directly connected with each other. So here are my lovely team members with their unique qualities and qualifications. So according to our plan, we have visited three villages and start working practically. We have done some surveys to know the real scenario. So here are the pics that, uh, pictures that show the, our work. Some precious moment, I guess. We have given some ducklings to the underprivileged people of Bangladesh so they can improve their financial status. So here are some pictures I am showing. So here are seminars we arrange in some villages to aware about their rights, to aware about the uh, nutrition. So these are the ducklings that we have given to them. And at the same time, we have done some seminars on nutrition and uh, aware of food adulteration in some schools so that guardians are very cautious about the health of their children. So we have, uh, we have sold some fresh food, adaptation free food to the schools. So these all are appreciated. And the ducklings we have provided to the, our villagers, the result is in front of you. The pictures that show the, our result. So these all are the members of our team. Uh, they are under our projects. You can see the smile in their face. At the time, we have with these sessions are not only educative, but also uh, was interesting. Working with such a joyful person, persons uh, at that time is a great experience. So here you can see our beautiful moments. Uh, I must say I have clicked this photo. Uh, I feel very proud that my flag is hanging with other countries. So is there any proud, it is a proud moment for any Bangladeshi people, I guess. 
So here is the moment when our we got our concept award, competing with different teams around the world. That is shortage. The fourth number you can see in the image. And also we are runners up at that night. So here is pictures of my with us. And I am very happy at that time. You can see shines in my eyes and uh, my happy face. So this is my social business creation family. Finally, I don't want to lose the opportunity to thanks to our international affairs teams, especially Mr. Sohid Rahan Islam and Kaji Mizbaul Rahman. Without their support, it's completely impossible to, for us to fulfill our journey. I still remember I had called any time, uh, disturbed them any time, and they respond me and figure out our problems and try to solve it at any moment. So especially thanks to both of them. And for this year, 2021, I know this year participant will level up the scale of, of this SBC and with their innovative ideas and solve many problems of our society. So I'm wishing them good luck and thank you all for hearing my speech. So I'm going to back Simran. Thank you so much, Ms. Zora Akhtar, for sharing your experience with us. It was wonderful. And I hope our students will get inspired by this. Um, last but certainly not the least, uh, it's time to call our next speaker, Fonsoya Poya, Coordinator of Social Business Creation, to share his valuable speech with us. Let's welcome Mr. Fonsoya. Hello, everyone. My name is Francois Poirier. I'm really pleased to be here with, with you today. I'm so honored to be here to talk to you about SBC. Um, let me um, share my screen. I will talk today a little bit about um, the logistic behind the competition. So let me give me uh, this right here. And you should be able to see my screen at any moment. Okay. Um, can you confirm that you um, see my slide at the moment? Yes, yes, sir. It's Thank you. So um, as I said, um, my name is Francois and I'm here to talk a little bit about logistics. My role here at uh, the, the SBC, the social business creation is one of coordinator, uh, but you can actually think of me about your, your support all the way from the first time you go to our website to the very last day in Montreal. Um, today, I want to talk to you a little bit about how the competition is run and what we do with you. Uh, so we're going to look at uh, the overview of the competition, um, how the admission process works, uh, our platform about the online content, um, Zone Co, which is where you're going to be able to interact with us during the competition to submit your work. And then we're going to have a, a look at our prizes and awards. So in terms of over overview and the logistic of the competition, it's fairly simple. While this slide is very crowded, what I want you to remember is um, after your, um, your project is accepted, um, you have four rounds to go through. And as my mentioned, we have um, a, a passing grade in order to be able to progress through the competition. But really our mission is really to inspire you and teach you about how to build a, a social business. Um, First, the admission process is uh, we have a deadline for the, the February 28th, and that's for entering your living lab. Your living lab is the project. So if you want to enter the competition with your own idea, your own project, uh, you can go through our admission process, which I will go right after this one. But um, I would the only thing I want you to remember is the deadline for the, the February 28th. It's really to enter with your own project but you can join the competition at any moment by joining an active living lab. So whether your own project falls through or for any reason you want to, to be able to grow your team, uh, know that you can add or join team members um, to an existing project at any moment during the competition. 
So the competition goes through four rounds where you're going to go through the social innovation process, the business innovation process, execution and scale up, and then impact. That's where you're able to showcase everything you've built over the several weeks and months you've worked on your project. Um, this alongside, we're going to uh, we're going to follow you with online training, virtual live training, um, all, all the way up to the grand final. The admission process is really simple. We're really working hard for, for to make this process as easy as possible. Um, so the admission for the living labs um, can be done either on an uh, online platform or even on a mobile platform. Going through our website, you will have direct access to this application form for your living lab. Um, I'm just gonna go over a few questions that are in the, in the form, just to make sure we highlight the most important one. The form is fairly easy to, is, it's actually really easy to fill. It's about a 10 minute process. Um, your first question you're gonna see is the project name. That's the project name of your living lab. Um, and the, the actual name and the project will change, will evolve over the competition, and that's perfectly fine with us. Uh, we just want to make sure that we lock down those living labs because those are the, the ideas that are going to go through the whole competition. Then you enter your team, your team members. And as I, as I mentioned, your team can evolve over the competition. You can add team members uh, even when in your round two, a semifinal. Uh, really, we want your project to evolve, so it's perfectly fine if your teams evolve as well. Um, we do need to have one team leader which we can contact in order to make sure we have the logistic, the proper logistic with you. Um, and the, the uh, only requirement that we have is that at least one of your team member is an active student. So we will need one student proof for the admission form. And then it's really about description of your project. And as I said, your project will evolve. It's perfectly normal because we're here to change mindset, to inform you about what actual um, social businesses. So it's perfectly normal that your ideas, your mindset evolve during the competition and so will your project. So here we want to know about your idea when your project, when you come in, but we can guarantee you that most of the project will be different when they come out. <laughs> Um, all of these projects need to be attached to at least one um, UN sustainable goal. So that's where in the admission process, you can explain how, what type of impact or impacts you're trying to have because you can attach more than one goal. Then once your project is accepted in the competition, you're going to have access to our EduLib platform. This is where you have access to all our, of our online content. Again, it's real easy to just sign in and right away have access to the social business creation content. Here, you're gonna have all our different modules for the rounds and all the rounds are explained in the, this is where you're gonna have access to all the content in order to really learn and craft your project into a concrete social business. In addition to that, we're gonna have live training, live lectures during the different um, rounds also. After that, you're going to also have access to our platform, which is called Zone Cool. And this is where you're going to have access to your calendar. This is where you're going to be able to uh, submit the written work. Um, so we're actually building at the moment um, really easy guides. Uh, so you're going to have a, a few PDF that's going to really be able to explain it and be a reference for you. Uh, while you go through the competition, because I know now I'm bombarding you with a lot of information. I just want to go really quickly as an overview, but know that we're here to help you and we're going to provide you with the proper documents in order to make sure that the process is as easy as possible. Uh, last, it wouldn't be a competition with, without really great prizes. So um, we have over $72,000 of prizes for the participant, both in cash and scholarships, uh, in, um, in tuitions, in formation. And then we also have prizes for our educational institution, our partners, for, to recognize the, the social impact creation they, they will provide during this competition. Um, so we, we're really happy to have great sponsors uh, like Scotiabank who supports social business creation and it's able to uh, bring this recognition to our participants. So again, my name is Francois Poirier. I'm the social business uh, creation coordinator 
And while my role is one of career coordinator, I really want you to think of me as your operation and logistics support. Um, really from the very first day you look at the competition to the very last day and furthermore, um, we're a growing international competition with a clear goal to inspire everyone to change the world through business creation. And to fulfill our mission, we actually upgraded our operation and logistic to better support you. Um, we want to support our partners, our participants, our coach, our mentors, our teachers. We really want, we're here to help and we, and you now have someone dedicated to help you every step of the way, which is me. <laughs> so know that if you have any questions, you have someone here to help you. And the easy, easiest way to reach us is by email at sbc at hec.ca, which also can be found on our website at socialbusinesscreation.hec.ca. And I'm going to end by um, saying it on my name and the name of the whole social business creation team. I would like to thank you all for your implication and just remember that we're here to help. Thank you so much. And I'm getting back to you and I'm going to stop sharing my screen now. Thank you. Thank you so much. It was a wonderful sharing where you have covered the whole criteria, which was much needed for our students. Thank you once again. Thank you. As we are running out of time, unfortunately, I think we are unable to take any questions. Uh, once again, I'd like to call Professor Dr. Muhammad Masum Iqbal, Dean Faculty of Business and Entrepreneurship, DIU, to conclude this whole session. Sir, I think you are muted. Okay, Madam Simran, uh, thank you so much. Could you please, uh, uh, I could not hear you, please. Yes, sir, uh, we can hear you, sir. Can you hear me? Okay, you are audible, sir. You are audible yes, and visible. Okay. Thank you, as well, thank you. Uh, Simran, could you please tell me again what you are saying to me? Simran, could you please just, tell me again? Yes, yes, sir. I'm just calling you to conclude this whole session okay. with your valuable speech. Yes, sir. Uh, so, uh, thank you so much, uh, Madam Simran, and uh, many, many thanks to the all the to all the speakers, uh, Maithai, Fraswa, Pauline, and my good colleague, uh, Majbur Rahman, for sharing your ex experiences and. All the information you have communicated uh, to all the participants and potential participants and to all the viewers and it has been a very important session for the potential uh, contestants in this competition in fact it is a global competition it is a global platform and uh, by joining or participating in this platform in this competition a contestant can can, can achieve a lot since it is a global platform so, and Understanding social business is very, very important. As I said earlier, only having a will or having a sweet will or sweet wish to start a social business is not enough. It requires clear understanding, determination, seriousness, uh, pragmatic plan, and so on. So this is the platform, as I mentioned by Freswa and uh, Maithai, even the experience of Pauline and Majba Rahman. So we, we can easily understand that. Yes, by joining this platform or this competition, we'll be able, the participants will be able to have that understanding and they will have a global experience uh, from this competition. So again, I pay thanks to all the uh, speakers over here uh, for your precious time, for your valuable time and uh, special thanks to the viewers for your time for watching us and special thanks, heartfelt thanks to all the uh, participants and potential contestants who are going to join at this competition and who have the willingness uh, to make a better world uh, in the days to come. So that is all about from me. And with this words, I would like to conclude. Thank you, Madam Simran. So uh, I hope uh, so it will be a very good competition like for all of us. Thank you so much.
Once again, thank you so much, sir. We thank are you. almost at the last stage of our webinar. Ma'am, um, do you want to say yeah. something? I uh, okay. I know that we don't have enough time to take questions, but then we are always here to answer your questions. So feel free to uh, write to us by uh, send us an email, or even go to our Facebook uh, for chatting if you have any questions. And so you have support from both Montreal and uh, from Bangladesh. So feel free to contact us at any time if you have any questions or any suggestions how to uh, help you learn better, how to help you become better entrepreneurs with a sense of higher purpose. Yes, ma'am, absolutely. So we are almost at the last stage of our webinar. I would like to thank each and everyone uh, who have watched our live patiently. You can reach out to us uh, as um, um, Dr. Maita mentioned, you, if you need any further assessment from us. We highly appreciate and uh, thank our today's resource person for joining us today with your valuable remarks. So hope we will be seeing you in our next um, webinar in possession or in competition. So till then, have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. So thank you, uh, Dr. Mai. And thank you, Prasoa. So we are not live now. Well, thank you. Thank but you thank for inviting you. us. Thank you. See, it was a great event indeed. Yeah, thank you very much. Well, yeah, so, so we it's... really look forward to your, uh, yeah, awesome. Look forward to uh, <laughs> Bangladeshi participation this year. It will yeah, be a big so... hit this year. <laughs> yeah, okay. of course. And we're we'll expecting a good, good number of participation. Yeah. yeah. So awesome. before leaving, let's let's have a group photo. So can we oh, take yeah. a group photo? Yeah, sure. Okay. So 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 Ryan will conducting the group photograph session. Okay, okay. So everyone, let's have a group photo. So cheese yeah. and with yeah. thumbs up. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And once so more, we have Thank social you very business much for your time. work. This one. Ah, yeah. So oh, we have to do this to get a fly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like that, right? Okay, if I do, yes, then we'll take way. You know, you have this. Cross, cross. So it's like this. Yeah, yeah. cross. It. cross. And then cross. I think I'm doing it right. Like this. You put, and then you reach this, your toes. This, this. Okay. Okay. One, <laughs> No, you have this, you have this, 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 this. and it turn like this, and this. Our hands cross. <laughs> yes. yes, I got it. Yeah, it's when you join hands. And you remember when we were in the audience that, you know, it's now it's just me, 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 and then now when we open our heart, and then we connect the chains. You yes, know, in the final, yes. in the final, we are connected uh, one hands with another hands. Yeah. Okay. But now online, right. now we just okay. do it. <laughs> Okay, let's take a group photo. Yeah, so we'll take the Mr. Nazmul, maybe. Yeah. Yes, yes. Okay, ready? Okay, Nazmul. Ready? ready? One, okay, one, two, two three. three. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you Thank and you so have a very good day. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Thank